What's up, everybody? Welcome to the show. This right here is going to be another Delta Force video. We're going to be diving into the different content updates that they're going to be dropping tonight, or I guess really the 16th. We're going to be talking about when the alpha is going to be ending and my predictions for release, along with a few other things. So let's just hop into the content first. Before I do that, make sure you guys join the Caliber Collective. I'm going to leave a link in the description below. Also, I'm going to be giving away some keys tonight on stream. And I usually give away all my keys either in Discord or during the stream. So if you need access to Delta Force, the developers have been pretty kind to give us a lot of keys to give away. So make sure you join both of those. So first things first, Aluru, which he's already in the game. He's going to be an engineer. I'm not going to dive too much into him. You should be able to play him and check him out whenever you're ready. Seems pretty cool. I haven't got to try him much myself. I just hope they keep him balanced and everything's good to go on that end. Let's talk about the Mandelbrick showdown that's going to be happening on the 16th. It seems like they might be upping the spawn rates of Mandelbricks and or the rewards. If you have not had the pleasure of getting a Mandelbrick and extracting with the data, it is an intense situation in the hazard ops mode. Lots of fun, so make sure you partake in that if you have not already, because it seems like they're going to be doing something to make that system a little more fun, a little more active. I don't know. We'll see. Dam infiltration. I'm pretty sure that's going to be on zero dam. There's going to be different spots you can go check out, maybe control for a certain amount of time where you can get in-game rewards. I will say this about Delta Force, how impressed I am with how they do their in-game reward system, their mail, things like that, the way they're doing things for their streamers and the content creator program and stuff like that. They're very solid on different systems that give people different things and things you can sign up for and all that stuff. It's a lot of information to keep up with, but nonetheless, it's very rewarding. And I've really enjoyed it. So shout out to the devs. Famous Firearms is going to be dropping. It's going to be some type of system that's going to reward modification solutions for your guns. And they're going to send that also in the game email. There's also going to be a King of the Hill game mode on Havoc Warfare. I'm not sure exactly what that is. I'm, I'm assuming it's either some sort of less likely, some sort of little battle royale mode or some type of hard point mode where there's a single point to control. Maybe smaller teams, not sure. But we'll have to see how that plays out. I'm definitely excited to test it and see what it is. And then the big one, it's going to be Space City, the new map. I'm going to show you a few things on screen right here. It seems like there's going to be some sort of alarm system, camera system on the map. A bunch of different type of AI, including a guy with a flamethrower, some sort of boss. I'm sure the loot's going to be different. I'm sure the rank play is going to be upped now. So you can actually climb the rank system on this map if you were capped before. I wanted to talk about this item real quick. I'm not really sure what it is. It's some sort of objective in the map. So they activate this and it brings down some type of rocket, SpaceX type of shit. And it seems like it's going to activate a lot of AI, probably incentivize a lot of PVP and the loot on it's probably going to be insane. So definitely excited to try the map out. That's going to be the absolute first thing I'm doing in, in that mode. Let's talk a little bit about the future of Tactical Turmoil. They've confirmed already that Tactical Turmoil is the other third of the game. You're going to have Tactical Turmoil, you're going to have Havoc Warfare, and then you're going to have the campaign. Hazard Operations is a mode within Tactical Turmoil. It is their extraction mode. So they're going to be adding, they've confirmed, they're going to be adding more modes to that tactical type of gameplay. I'm not sure if it's going to be a PvE mode. I'm not sure if it's going to be some sort of like search and destroy PvP type mode. I'm not sure. But it's actually really cool that at first I thought it was going to be just simple, leave an extraction mode, have a large scale multiplayer like Battlefield and then the campaign. But it seems like they're going to actually add different modes within these three different categories. So definitely excited to see how that plays out. Let's talk about when the alpha is going to be ending. It's going to be early September is their goal. If they get everything they need, uh, they, they should be ending it within the first two weeks of September. And then moving on to an early release of the game, I'm assuming pretty quickly within this year. They already have four seasons worth of content pushed out. And with their seasons lasting about three to four months, that's already over a year of content that they have ready to go. So I'm assuming if quality of life and the game stable and all that, I'm assuming they're going to open it up to early access pretty quickly after that. I would imagine the end of the summer, if not the fall sometime. So that's all I have for this video, guys. I just wanted to up update some of you. If you have any questions, comments, concerns about the game, I'll be sure to answer them. Just make sure you leave them here. There's a lot of different confusing systems and the game is very well put together. So I myself have been trying to learn as much as I can about it so I can provide information to others when they need it. And I've really enjoyed it. So I hope you guys have too. And again, don't forget to join the Caliber Collective and check out the stream tonight. I will catch you guys on the next video. Thank you.